sometimes I wish that at four years old, 14 years old, 24 years old, 34 years old, that I had someone in my role, that I could have a woman to look up to. My name is Liz Smith, and I am a senior advisor to Pete on communications. I've been obsessed with politics since I was about nine years old. Um, my parents got me involved. I started volunteering when I was 17. I started interning on campaigns when I was 19 and started working full time on campaigns when I was 21. So I've done about close to 20 campaigns in, in different capacities. I always wanted to work in politics. I always wanted to have a leadership role, but I didn't know that it existed. When you look at, at, at old uh, photos of presidents, you saw two types of women around them their wives and their daughters. Whether it's a, a woman or a man that I've worked for, no one has empowered me. No one has given me a seat at the table in the way that Pete has. I feel so empowered and I'm so lucky to be a part of a team that is built up of so many strong, opinionated women. I oversee everything from his media strategy to his message and branding um, and debate prep. All right, hey guys, so we'll go through the whole spiel tomorrow. Day to day is really just make sure that the, the campaign stays true to who he is and what he believes in. Yes, it is, it is. Okay. Generally, when you think of campaigns, you think of sort of the old boys club. You know, the guys going to play basketball or going to grab beers afterwards. On our campaign, you know, the, the most outgoing, the loudest people. <laughs> the people who really are making the decisions day to day, it's majority women. For so long, you know, women have been sort of pushed to the side or served as window dressing, whereas we really have an influential role in this campaign. And, you know, frankly, sometimes we're the ones who are getting things done. I have a lot of respect for the women who are running. And it's not easy to throw your hat in the ring, especially when you're a woman. I just know from my personal experience that Pete is gonna be the best advocate for women. It's gonna be good. He's the first presidential candidate in history to commit to appointing 50% of his cabinet and 50% of all of his judicial appointments, at least 50% as women. And we've never seen that commitment to equality um, in any administration in history. I think in this line of work, it's very easy to become very cynical, to become jaded, and to think of this sort of like it's a game. But with Pete, you know, he does bring out that still alive, idealistic side of me. Yeah. Well, really reminds me why I got involved in politics in the first place. I've never worked for anyone like him. I've never been inspired by anyone like him. And at a time when our country is sort of down in the dumps and people are facing just these massive challenges, the hope and optimism that he can give, you know, an old jaded soul like me is something that I think he can bring to America as well. Let's go change the game and win this election.